Hey everybody, uh, today we're going to try out a new game called Goobies. Um, it is kind of like a vampire survivors type game, kind of potato like where you get upgrades every level. Um, you have these meta progressions that stick with you um, for future runs, so that's kind of the vampire survivors type um, thing. Um, with the medic progression, but uh, we're gonna do a run or two today and see how we like it. And uh, um, depending on how long the runs are, we might do two runs, but um, let's see. Okay, so you can also unlock artifacts, but I don't have any. Um, there are also other characters you can unlock. Um, we only have the first one because we haven't done any runs. Uh, Wiggle Woogle, um, you get an extra item upon leveling so that's good and the items are generally better rarity so that's also good he has base hp of eight uh six speed six damage 0.7 seconds on his rate of fire and 1000 range so let's uh let's get into the run and see how this goes um all right so it does auto fire, so you can kind of just, um, I guess a mouse isn't really needed. Um, you can't control yourself with the mouse. Uh, let's uh, go with attack speed. Attack speed is always good. These type of games, faster you attack, faster you can kill. Um, the little blue dots like this are XP. Um, XP is down here. Um, kind of a wave style game. Um, um, so let's get a little AoE. Um, this is uh, Enemies Ignite. Um, There, that one there, you could see the uh, the fire, um, and you can see it hitting the other the other enemies. Um, there are mini bosses and bosses in this game. Let's kind of try to group them up a bit. It's gonna make it easier with our our new fire ability to kill them all. We've got fire again, Halo. I know this is good. Uh, Initial attacks will pierce, but they do less damage each time they pierce. We're gonna stick with fire though So that's how you can see if we click this button we can see our damage our damage multiplier movement speed Critical strike damage your critical strike chance all your stats that way. Okay. Um, also, something that feels really good about this game is when you do get your upgrades, uh, they're just not a flat amount. Um, they incrementally get better, which is really good feeling. Um, we're going to see how long our run goes. Um, okay, so we got Implode, which is another AoE. Chain Lightning, which is really good. Uh, Damage Cell has a chance to critical strike. 10% uh, more critical strike and more critical strike damage. Uh, this is really good where you can go with that. More damage. Always more damage. Doing pretty good. Clearing these, I mean, it is the first level, but we are clearing them out quite easily. Um, let's skip even more attack speed. I like attack speed. It's, uh, so that is a mini boss right there. Um, this is a vacuum boy. He kind of sucks you in. Um, so we kind of want to stay away from him. There you can see the vacuum effect on him. Um, so we kind of want to get him down and he'll give us uh, kind of a cool 
cool thing about this uh, game is you'll get a roulette wheel. Um, don't want to get uh, put in a bad spot over there, so. Um, when you're getting closer to the level you, and you're picking up the XP, you can hear the uh, the tones getting higher pitch, which is kind of cool. Uh, looking kind of a audio cue. Um, we're going to take fire again. Uh, tranquilizing mass, that's something that spins around you. Uh, this is a piercing thing and frost bolts just not very good um cool thing is you can see the upgrades so instead of 20 percent chance if i choose this i'll have 22.5 percent chance to ignite them um upon death dealing one damage uh every 0.5 seconds for two seconds so duration went up damage went up and the chance to do it went up with that upgrade oh there's another mini boss we are being sucked in. Um, we got hit a little bit. Um, right now, the, they don't do a lot of damage, but that obviously will scale with, in time. We got another vacuum boy. I think uh, I just heard the bosses will be incoming soon. That's health right there. I think that's what that means. All right, so this is our fire thing is upgrading to wildfire now. It ignites an AOE wildfire upon death, dealing one damage every. So, this is the the difference here is the wildfire deals up to two times additional damage based on the number of enemies hit. So, we are obviously taking that. All right, and Zigrid, he is the boss of this level. Um, but we're gonna try to get these. Uh, Zigrid's the one doing these. Uh, we're gonna try to get these mini bosses down. Um, our damage is kind of low at the moment, but uh, the vacuum boy's pulling us into the other ones. Um, this is straight damage. But we're gonna do this one. Yeah, gonna stick into the wire wildfire idea. Try to avoid the stuff on the ground. There's Zigrid up in the corner. You can see him. Oh gosh, ow. Oh man, this is gonna be a real short run. Real short run. I can't, uh, with no, uh, no meta progression or anything, um, not living very good. Maybe, maybe we'll come down here, see if we can swing around and get that health. Or not. There we go, got it. Jeez. Alright, we get a roulette wheel. It gives us a random upgrade. Uh, that's implode, so attacks have a 10% chance to implode upon impact, displacing and stunning enemies, and dealing 5 a AoE damage. We can also dissolve down here for half a level, but we're going to take the upgrade because we just, we need the help, need the damage. Um, this red guy, he, uh, explodes. Um, we really could use some health. We're going to die. Uh, we're gonna take Splinter. They have a twenty percent chance of Splinter, um, three times dealing impact, dealing two damage each. So makes our attacks split, do more damage. Yada yada yada. That sound is another mini boss. Hopefully it's not another suction boy. Um, so here's the ultimate edition, or we already have the ultimate edition of wildfire. It uh, goes up to four damage um, now. Um, but we're gonna take this because our stuff will splinter up to six times instead of three times.
and we got hit by that. So we are definitely going to do another run. Uh, you can now aim your shots. Uh, that is kind of nice. But uh, yeah, we're just going to retry. We're going to do it with the same guy. Um, get another run in. Um, um, maybe even three runs because these are awfully short. Maybe four. Who knows? Um, hopefully they'll last a little longer and we can get some some better upgrades, I guess. Um, uh, these aren't very really good, but we'll take the implode right away. Um, that's an on-hit effect, so maybe uh, that'll be good. Um, there's some that are just astronomically better than than other upgrades in this game. Um, like most games, but um, implodes kind of middle range. Um, sla slash is pretty good. This is the more movement speed, the more damage you do. Sonic Hills Howl is like uh, AoE around us. There you can kind of see it. Um, so we'll, we'll try a Sonic Cow build if we can get multiple upgrades of that. Uh, that'd be a fun build to try out. Um, and kind of see how it goes. Um, let's not get surrounded. Um, you know what? Let's get a little pierce going on too. That way... We can hit enemies more than one time with, with our projectiles. That would be good also. There you see the implode. The, the black hole thing there is imploding. Um, so you can kind of see what it has going on. Um, throughout the, the series, if you guys like it, we will... Uh, ooh, we can... Get some chain lightning, tree hugger. Um, we're gonna take chain lightning just because we need more damage. If you guys like the series, though, comment and let me know, and let me know what kind of builds you want me to do, and um, we'll, we'll give it a shot. If you like the game, you know, then we'll we will make the series. But um, it's a fun game, nice, nice, fun, chill type uh, type game. That, and do multiple runs on. Um, I'm gonna go with Crushed Rubies here. Um, I really want the crit chance and crit damage because um, as you can see, with that 10%, we have a 15% critical strike chance. So I really wanna get that up higher. Um, that'll really be beneficial. Fifteen uh, percent chance to crit is really low, so um, these on death guys are kind of nice because when they or these exploding guys they hurt the other enemies. Um, we got the this again, so we're gonna get another seven and a half percent crit chance and another twenty five percent crit damage. Which we're gonna go with that, um, and you can see the the. Uh, the red numbers there, those are our crits. So, um, one thing about this game is uh, the mini bosses are random. So, some runs you can have a lot, and another run you might not have hardly any, and it's kind of by chance. So, uh, luck of the draw, I guess, on that. Um, we're going to take more Sonic Cal. Um, give them more damage. Uh, so if they get close to us, it's going to hurt them. Hopefully more than it hurts us. <laughs> um, there's more Sonic Owl. We will go with this. This one, Thick Hide is Defense. Uh, this is a really good one as well, but it's uh, Explode on Death. Um, but I want more damage. Uh, this makes the uh, Sonic Owl, this upgrade will make the Sonic Owl bigger. Um, and it pulses faster for more damage. So that's why we're gonna take that one. Um, so that, that is obviously a nice upgrade. Let's uh, circle around these guys. I don't wanna get trapped over there. Uh, 
We're at least gotta beat the first map. At least gotta beat the first map, let's go. We'll sit here for a minute and then we'll circle up and around to the... No, we're gonna circle around the bottom actually. Looks like a little tight with the rocks. You can't go over the rocks. Uh, so this will give us another 7.5% crit chance and another 35% crit damage. We are going to go with that. We'll check our crit chance now. We are at 30%. So almost 1 in 3 is a crit. Uh, which is nice. You can see 14 crit damage. 11 crit damage on the implode there. Um, you can see the chain lightning. That's doing 14 crit damage. That's nice. Let's not go that way. We'll circle around the all the way to the outside. Pick up some of this XP, maybe get closer to another level. Oh man, see all these exploded guys? Oh jeez. Uh, we have a different boss this time. We have Magnus. Magmus. Um, we're gonna take Chain. And I'm getting hit, I'm getting hit. Let's get out of here. Um, that thing right there is a magnet. Oh, we just had a mini boss spawn too. So this is gonna get a little hairy. I got hit right there. Um, I must have got too close to the red. Oh gosh. So we're gonna try to circle around this way and hopefully it pops or we get around. There, yeah, we missed Magmus's laser. Do the same thing, but the other way. Oh my gosh, we're getting swarmed here. A goo. This one is very good. Attacks have a 15% chance to change conjure goo that homes and seeks out an enemy in range and um, exploding into a small radius, dealing three damage. So that yellow is the goo we're shooting out. Um, it's just kind of extra damage we're gonna take this magnet um we're gonna take uh this is just a flat 15 percent damage on everything we'll take it i kind of wanted the chain lightning there too but oh well here we go we'll take chain lightning right now and another another level into the chain lightning Oh, he's looking this way, so we're going to circle back around the other way. Trying to be able to damage both the boss and the mini boss, but I don't have enough AoE built up yet to be able to do that. So um, we'll just kind of circle around, catch, catch some XP when we can, and uh, try not to get uh, hit by that. That big laser he's doing. Oh, I just got hit by that. I didn't have as much movement speed as I was hoping to get through that. As long as we play it safe, we'll be able to beat the boss for sure. Um, so we can get an upgrade on Sonic Howl or an upgrade on Chain Lightning. Um, we're going to take this upgrade on Chain Lightning because we get a Lightning Strike out of it. Um, and I just think it, it's a 50% chance, so it's just going to be straight up more damage. And I don't need to be right next to him. Ow, that hurt. Um, that hurt also. Oh gosh. Don't, don't get caught in, in all this stuff. You can see the, the lightning striking there. That's nice. Magnus is down to uh, 373 HP now. Come on, stop firing. Stop firing your laser. Okay, let's go. Let's go circle around this way. Alright, so... Or you can take one... Damage on all projectiles. Critical strikes have a 20% chance to cause a slash. AoE damage. I think we'll take AoE damage. That's going to help out my, my goose. Um, I don't really like any of the other ones. 
so. Oh, this is not a good spot to be in. I'm kind of trapped over here. Let's swing all the way around. All the way around. There we go. Also helps my implode damage uh, that AoE did. Alright, we get another upgrade on the goo. Um, so we go to a 17% chance, but we're launching two goos. That's huge right there. Just picked up some more health. You can see the goos, the yellow goos bouncing around out there. That's nice. And I just got hit because I didn't see where that was going. Oh gosh, we're gonna get trapped over here. I don't like it. I don't like it. Uh, he's spinning around the other way. He's gonna fire that laser right at us. He only has 11 health though, so we're just gonna come and nuke him real quick. All right, give us something good. All right, we got 30% crit damage. We'll take it. All right, let's take uh, the ultrasonic wave. Uh, since we kind of do have enemies close to us. And, and some of the enemies we're killing. Spawn more enemies. There we got the other mini boss there. And we got another 40% crit damage. So we really need to be critting. Uh, get that damage. Uh, so this will take you to the next level. All right, we beat the first boss, beat the first level, first map. Um, so we're gonna have things starting to come in on us and hopefully we don't get s completely surrounded. These big guys are the ones that spawn more mobs on us. Maybe we should get some on death effects like the fire or the the exploding fire um, those are two very good upgrades um, those red things are from these guys with the four legs they they fire from range on you um, so you gotta pay attention to that so you're not getting hit by those you just saw my chain lightning go again all right here we go so we can have another upgrade on yeah, we're going to take this other upgrade. It's uh, more damage to enemies that get close faster. Uh, we're going to swing around and see if we can't get some damage on these ranged guys that are trying to hit us from afar. I don't like it. It's hard to dodge them. And these guys are fast runners, so got to be aware of those too. just kind of circle around all of them hopefully um, problem is, is they're kind of pushing each other so even though we are slightly faster than them uh, we're getting so many enemies that they're getting pushed into us but we're just gonna try to make wide circles around them and hopefully we'll be able to kill enough of them that uh, we can thin them out a bit Oh, some health just dropped, but it's in, in the middle of all that, so. I think we're about to get pushed in here. Um, we're going to take the upgrade here um, on Chain Lightning again. But we're, we're getting a lot of enemies on top of us, so that's not very good. And we just had a mini boss spawn. Also, not the best thing for us at the moment. Could re oh, and it's the uh, vacuum boy. So we're being pulled in right now. Yeah, I don't think we're gonna make it through this. Yeah, yeah. Oh, oh. Well, we made it through that part. Oh, don't, don't fire on those guys. Those guys are going to spawn more on us. Um, I think we should uh, take an on-death effect. Maybe we can kill them. And... Oh, we got another mini-boss. Uh, maybe the on-death will help 
keep them under control. Oh, we got fast runners on us. We need to start clearing them out. Need to clear some out. We're, we're not clearing enough out to, to survive. We're down to 2.6 L, so. Oh, kind of got out of range of my attacks a little bit there. So that doesn't help either. Another mini boss just spawned. Look at all the range guys trying to take us out. All these. All these red spots are them shooting at us. Um. This is really nice, but. I think I'm going to take the salvage energy because if we explode, we're going to do 50% of our combo, which you see down here as damage. And that could be a lot of damage. That could really help us take a lot out. There, you just saw it explode, took a bunch out. Um, that in general is a very, can be a very good upgrade, but we are. Oh, I should have gone for that health. I just saw it. We got Magnus again. I don't think we're going to make it through another boss fight and the mini bosses. And we got the vacuum boy. And now we got armored guys. That's what these guys are. They're kind of guys with helmets. Uh, we'll take another fire. Maybe. Maybe. We'll try. We'll see what happens. But, uh... I just don't think we have the damage yet. Maybe we can get some of those meta progression upgrades and whatnot. See how that goes. We're going to swing back over. Grab this health. Make us feel a little more comfortable. That fire is putting in work. You can see it. Oh, we got another upgrade on the chain lightning. Uh, so 25% chance to spawn it. A chain of five lightnings upon impact dealing 5.7 damage 5.75 damage that also have a 50% chance to spark two lightning strikes dealing nine damage each chain has a 25% chance to generate a lightning attack from the player dealing 1.14 damage we take this we take this legendary upgrade let's go You know, maybe I was wrong. You know, we are almost 15 minutes into this run. It's only our second run ever in this game. Um, and, you know, we're still above half health. And we are getting them down slowly. But we are getting uh, the, the size smaller. Um, I think here we're going to take... Uh, this chain so our attacks chain um they'll have a 50 percent chance chain to two enemies dealing six damage instead of one enemy um well, they are getting a little close to us though and there you can see the armored guys oh magnus is going the other way and we're being sucked in uh that was our combo thing blowing up Ooh, ooh. Yeah, that laser was a little close. Let's take the fire once again. A little better chance, a little more damage. Um, Magnus has over 3,000 health this time. But, uh, oh, we got some of the big boys in there too. The chain lightning looks like it's putting in work. Um, at the end of this run, uh, we will we'll look and see what's doing the damage. So we can we can check that. And we'll see what what. I know we're real early into this game, but we'll we'll see what's doing the damage for us. All right, we got the wildfire. Two times additional damage based on number of enemies hit. Well, we don't have a lot of enemies anymore, but that's okay. Um, because some of these guys explode into more enemies. And we still have more enemies coming in. There we go. Clear us away to get through. That feels nice. 
get, get on the outside of these guys. Yes. Oh my gosh. Kill it. Kill that vacuum boy. Oh gosh. I clicked the wrong button and it uh, pushed me right into him. Come on, vacuum boy. Oh no. I'm right in his laser. Oh god. Oh god. Stop laser. Stop the lasers. Oh gosh. Give me the health. Oh, okay. I got vacuum boy. All right, we got 60% crit chance. Let's go, 60%. Look at that, we're at 90% crit chance right now. So almost every shot is a crit now. Almost every single one. 23 damage, that's huge. All right, we're gonna swing back around the other way. Hopefully Magnus isn't gonna be hitting us. Yeah, we're, we're outside the laser. I'm trying to make sure we get the mini boss kills. Um, I need to, I need to swing all the way around. Uh, his laser's gonna be too close if I don't. But now that I know his laser was right there, I'm gonna swing back towards the mini bosses, make him spin the other way, and make my attacks focus on, hopefully, the mini bosses a little more. I also don't like it up here because of these rocks right here. I'm afraid I'm going to get trapped in there and not be able to uh, get myself out and just get swarmed. Alright, we're going to take... Uh, I think we're going to take this. It deals more damage, 0.2 damage for movement speed. Uh, we have six movement speed, so it's not a lot of damage, but maybe if we get a little more, it'll do better for us. We're, uh, we're going to try to melt this. Oh, that mini boss just exploded. And we got 10% AoE radius, which isn't bad. It helps us with the fire. and So we got one... Uh, Crumble Sapphire, which gave us a 20% damage increase. We'll take that. We'll take that all day. All right, now we, uh, you know, I stand corrected. I think we will get this boss now. It does look like it. First run did not do good. We didn't even down one boss. This one, we're going to down two. If I don't get swarmed, that is. But as you can see, our goo's putting in work. The wildfire's putting in work. Our uh, chain lightning's doing real well for us. Uh, we're doing a lot better than we were at clearing clearing the pack out. Um, we got a bit of work to do on single target yet, but we are doing a lot better than we were just a few minutes ago. And this is our second run. We don't have any meta progression yet, so you know, we gotta keep that in mind. You know, that meta progression helps every single run. So, oh, uh, I just ran into one of the guys that explode into more mobs. Uh, I'll stay over here for a minute. Oh, gotta stay out of those. Magnus has 200 health, get him. There we go. Do something good. Big upgrades. So we got 20% AOE radius. We have a decent amount of AOE. That'll help. Uh, we got a magnet. Um, we'll increase the damage of all AOE by another 15% on that upgrade. I want to kill these guys so I can get the, those upgrades, get the XP. These are almost up to another, this is your XP bar. We're almost up to another level, so. We are in a dangerous spot health-wise. We're just above half health, so. Um, you can see more armored guys. Oh gosh, we got the rocks. I don't like these rocks. We made it though. We'll see how we s start off handling uh, more of these uh, waves. Hopefully we don't have them survive like we were last time. 
our combo thing just exploded. Um, heard it, it, and just saw it killed a bunch of things. I think I'm gonna try to fight my way through here. Oh, this isn't looking too good, boys. Not looking too good at all. These armor guys take a lot to kill. And then these guys are gonna explode into more stuff, more enemies. We're gonna swing around, try to kill all these range guys on the outside, just get our last upgrade to the wildfire once again. Oh, oh we just had a mini boss spawn in. He's right there. Um, these red explosions are the wildfire. Or not the red, the orange explosions, excuse me. I'm just trying to get away from the exploding guys. Why don't you kill them? Oh my gosh, look at all those explosions. That was great. That helped out a lot. I cleared out so many. Let's see if we can uh, not get surrounded here. Work our way through. I want to go up so I can keep damaging the mini boss. Still, still hanging in there. We're gonna pick up that magnet if we can. There we go. Now we're gonna get some levels. All right. So let's just straight up increase our damage by twenty-five percent. We're almost to another level, actually. That magnet uh, gave us a lot of XP. Oh gosh, I just about ran into. It. Oh no, no, we're getting boxed in. We're getting boxed in. Tree hugger's not gonna help. That gives us XP uh, for standing on the trees. Let's take one bonus projectile damage. I don't wanna get boxed in here. All right, we just killed the mini boss. Uh, five more percent crit chance. Let's Uh, the reason I'm running down into them is I'm trying to give us a little more space because we are very rapidly getting boxed in and um, oh, there it was we were at point one health so we unlocked Dizzy Wizzy um, enemies killed by him his attacks generate an explosion dealing 50% of the damage dealt that's cool and we got an artifact uh, Double trouble. Couple bosses. Uh, so that's two bosses. Um, you know what? Let's do one more run. One more. We were at 95% crit chance. That's really good. Um, oh, you know what? Let's uh, end. Yeah, let's end the run. Um, well, let's go see. Can we get some upgrades? So that's more XP. That just means more levels, more upgrades, faster. Bigger AoE. That's nice. More range. More movement speed, more health, more crit hit chance. Uh, oh gosh, we can't. Plus one projectile. That's huge. Regen. Chance of rare items. Plus 10% base damage. I really want this. But I'm thinking we take the movement speed. And then... Why don't we just do more XP? All right, um, let's do one more run. We're not gonna put any of these on. I'm definitely not doing any bosses. Uh, let's, uh, you know what? Let's do a dizzy wizzy run. Why not? There we go. We're gonna do a dizzy wizzy run. Oh, he has more health. He's slower. That's not gonna be good. Does more damage. Fire slower but has more range. So we're gonna have to stay away a little bit. Oh gosh, he dizzy. Yeah, he uh, he's dizzy all right. So we are going to need some attack speed with him for sure. But I do like 
the fact that he clears things out so quick. That is nice. All right, uh, there we go. Attack speed right away. So we were at two, one shot every two seconds with him. Um, so I think uh, if we can get another attack speed upgrade, you know what? Let's um, let's try Splinter. That sounds like it could be maybe good with him. Not really noticing his stuff splinter at all. Um, we're gonna take it's early. Let's take XP gain again, um, and maybe that'll uh, give us enough with our other XP gain we just got to to really help us out. We can take XP gain again, so even more XP. We'll be getting some levels this time, hopefully. Uh, and tax speed again, yes please. kind of getting trapped over here but it's not as bad because I clear out more than one with every hit it's not as bad as last time would have been um, so uh, you know I, I'm kind of curious what is your guys' favorite character to play with if you played this game um, and uh, yeah let me know let me know um, what, what your favorite character is and, uh, you know, uh, what your your favorite upgrade or item in the game is. Um, because it, it's really... I like this game. It's a lot of fun. Um, let's take this. Uh, it's a passive and it increases our damage. Uh... Are dealing damage to enemies above 95% HP we have a chance to deal 25% of that damage again so we do more damage to higher health targets basically yeah yeah it's not too too bad he's really good at clearing out mobs or like packs of mobs early game is pretty pretty nice uh i can really see like getting that extra um we're gonna take girthed up and i love this this name girthed up that's that's just an awesome name um <laughs> and make sure he always bigger uh getting extra projectiles like that straight up just doubles your damage you know you know one extra projectile just doubles your damage right off the bat uh, as a metal progression, that is an awesome idea. Um, it's gonna make run so much easier when when I'm able to get that. Um, so here's our crit chance again. We are 100% taking this. Gotta love it. Try to get that 100% crit rate. You know, so you can always do that extra, extra damage. It's, you know, is uh, your your critical strike damage is a multiplier on your damage, so it really, really helps take things out quick. All oh, right, um, blobbering, honestly, one of the worst items in the game. Um, I will never take this um, uh, I'd like to show you guys the exploding fire I know I had a chance to take it last run but um, um, if I see it this run we will surely take that 
All right, we got Zigrid as our boss. Um, so we are gonna take Chain. Actually, we're gonna take this. We're still on the first level. It's an extra ten percent XP again. Um, and we already have two points into it. Oh gosh, Zigrid. Zigrid's probably the worst boss for us with our low attack speed. Or low movement speed, sorry. Not low attack speed, our low movement speed. And that's why when he does stuff like that. Um, increase the damage of all our AoE stuff or make them bigger. Let's increase the damage. I'm all about the damage. Let's do more damage. Ow. I barely got touched there, but I did. I just got touched again. Hey, this, when he does this, it's not so bad. It's when he does the rapid fire like that. That really hurts. Unfortunately, I'm taking the things out around him, I'm, but I'm not really doing much damage to him at the moment. And we just got a mini boss spawn in. It's not really the best for us. <laughs> and it's the, the vacuum boy. He's right there. And I'm being hit by Zigrid. Oh well, that's okay. I mean, it's not, but I'm being vacuumed. We haven't. Even, we just touched the mini boss for our first time. That's not good. Uh. Well, okay. So even though they're gonna do less damage, we're getting an extra projectile. And with this guy, that might not be too bad since our projectiles explode and do damage. So while it's not very good that they do less damage, I don't like that. But uh, the extra projectiles, I'm hoping outweigh it I'm kind of getting uh, circled here I'm trying to oh gosh that exploding guy just hit me I'm trying to to work my way around to hurt and Zigrid and the mini boss that uh, with the the upgrades I have at the moment, um, it's a little difficult. Um, I just got hit by that little guy. I'm being sucked in. I'm being sucked in. Another mini boss just spawned. down to half health. This mini boss is spawning more things, which actually isn't that bad. It is kind of helping me because it's giving me more XP, which is giving me more upgrades. Uh, I'm about to die. Increase my damage by 15%. Why as well? I'm getting sucked in. I don't have much range. I'm noticing with him. Oh gosh, that hurt bad. 
I'm down to 1.4 health. I need some health to drop. I might not make it out of the first level. I might not make it out of the first level. I did not. Oh my gosh. We are going to do one more run. Just one more. Do I have enough for any other upgrades? Uh, yes. Oh my goodness, we're going to go back to uh, Wiggle Woogle. I like having the extra item choice um, and, and the movement speed. The movement speed is really what it is for me. Um, and the attack speed. Oh my gosh, <laughs> the other guy attacks so slow. Dizzy Wizzy. Um, Maybe when I get some more meta progression, it'll be uh, a little easier playing him. But for now, I think I need to stick with this guy. Um, first upgrade, we're going to take the extra projectile. We're going to see how it does on this guy. Look at that. And it makes it such a world of difference. Um, now, like, oh, well, if I can get him, the on attack effects the decent ones it really will make a difference if i'm hitting it with two things instead of one um right now i'm going to take the movement speed so i can get out of situations like even that one movement speed it is noticeable i can feel the difference um so i can and just stand here, clear them out a little bit. It's not not too bad. We don't need this magnet. Uh, let's go ahead and take this salvage energy. It's uh, it's gonna give it to me. I'm gonna take it. I'm not gonna argue. Um, we're gonna take a little explosion to kill kill some mobs. And I'm fine with that. I want to see some some good stuff on the roulette wheels and uh, you know maybe multiple upgrades of of some some uh, some items not just not just good stats because you can get up to four upgrades on an item from a single roulette wheel so it uh, it can really make your run uh, we we got to take the chain the the crit chances here but. Uh, Actually, you were taking a crit chance. <laughs> the chain is very nice, though, but um, I can't pass up crit chance. The chain doesn't do nothing if you, if you don't have any damage back in you, and crit is a great way to, to get that damage. Again, it's a multiplier, so... Oh, the movement speed just to get out of situations is so nice. Well, there it is again. We're taking it. I do like the attack speed idea. I did see it. I'm going to pretend like I didn't see the blobbering. Because I, there's no way I want it. But uh, we, we'll call it after this run. Maybe um, um, we'll, if you guys like it, we'll do we'll do more runs of this and um, and uh, yeah, I, I do enjoy the game. It is a lot of fun. All right, now we'll take the chain. Now we'll take it. It didn't have crit as an opposing option, so. You know, now my attacks can chain into other things with crits. I like that idea much better. Alright, now. Let's see if we can get uh, some multiple upgrades of goo. Or I'd like to show you guys the, uh, the other exploding uh, 
on death effect other than wildfire. We've had wildfire enough. Let's try something else. Speaking of wildfire, you know what? We're gonna take tree hugger. If we get a second one, it gives us more XP um, for standing in trees. But if we get another one, it can actually drop items, which are levels effectively. So why don't we just go stand over here? These are trees, these things right here. You just saw the XP explosion. There's another one. We're gonna, oh, well, if you insist, game, I guess I will take more, more crit. So we're gonna, we're gonna be spending our life in the trees, guys. Need some more on hit slash on death effects to, to really get this run going but maybe maybe we'll try to use these guys to help explode them i didn't need that but okay okay now we're gonna cause a bleed with our crits so we got 25 percent crit chance 250 crit damage and a 20 percent or in adding a stack of bleed causing 20 percent of my damage over three seconds and my crit chance is 30% now. So I have a base of 5% plus uh, the 25 from that item. Let's go up here and see if we can get them. All right, we have a different boss for you guys to see. Uh, it's a mom. Um, so he can um, sh shoot random little balls like that or he can do another attack. Here's his other attack, there it is. And that is all this boss does, that is it. I don't want this one again. The wildfire is really, really good, especially once you start getting your uh, attacks built up. Um, we're, gonna, we're gonna take the implode. I could use some on hit effects and that's exactly what that is. Here we go, explosive blobs. Okay, so this is an on death effect. Enemies have a 10% chance to explode on death, dealing six AOE damage. But um, this one is very nice. Um, that orange, what you just saw, the orange explosion there, that was the uh, exploding blob blobs. Um, so, uh, when that one gets leveled up, if we can level it up in this run, um, it is, uh, it's really good also, and it, it really helps, uh, clear out the, the packs and does a lot of damage. Uh, alright, we got a vacuum boy, which is not the best, but, um, we will try to deal with the, the vacuum boy as best we can. Uh, we're gonna take another implode here. Oh gosh, I am being sucked in by the vacuum boy. I like a mom when he does that because it's easy to avoid just two shots. Uh, when he does this and you're trying to avoid other things and you're being sucked in, it is uh, a little bit harder. Mom is about a little under half health actually. The mini boss is also about half health. I want to get the mini boss down before a mom dies. Oh gosh, I'm getting sucked in. Ow, ow, ow. But mini boss, the vacuum boy is almost done. I don't want to sit there and get greedy and try to kill him when I being circled. All right, so we got the vacuum boy. We get two 
Okay, so this is an upgrade to our combo thing, and now we get damage um, for our combo, and we get regen, so that's a very good upgrade. Um, since I got hit, I am gonna run up here, grab the health. Um, you know what? Why not? Let's take even more crit rate, more crit damage. More of that damage goes to more bleeding. I'm okay with it. Let's not get hit going for health. Lose health going for health. That's not very good. Let's see what see what a mom has to give us when we uh, finally get him down. As you can see, we are back to full health because of that regen of the, the combo thing. So that's huge. Um, there is a one more upgrade to that one. And it uh, makes you explode with uh, more XP at the, when you lose your combo. So that is... More XP is definitely a good thing. All right, we got another uh, explosive blobs. It increases damage by a uh, 50%, and we have another 5% chance for it to trigger. It's very good. Those are the orange explosions. There went a mom. Let's see what we get. Give us something good. So we got two times the explosion, exploding blobs. So now it's exploding fire pool. So it's a 15% chance to explode on death, dealing 9 AoE damage and leaving a pool of fire damage, uh, dealing two damage every second. We take that in a heartbeat. And we get a magnet. Your initial attack will fork into two weaker projectiles, dealing 1.5 damage. Uh, let's take the thousand needles. We are going into the needle idea. Give us a little more spread. There is the exploding blob. Oh, I want the XP, that's why we're still here. Uh, I don't need the health, but we'll run into it on our way. All right, I'll let you guys get to see the exploding blobs. Um, here you can see we have four levels in it. Um, hopefully we can uh, show you the final final uh, form if you will um, let's take thick hide it's uh, regenerate and take less damage just in case we get a little swarm we do have the enemies right here that uh, explode into more enemies so it could happen uh, the reason I like this on trigger effect is because you kill some it can trigger and then when it triggers, it kills more. And it can just keep triggering on top of itself. And just wipes out whole waves just like that. Just like that. Uh, and it uh, is extremely helpful. <laughs> um, we're getting kind of backed into a corner. Let's see if we can get out of here. I haven't got the tree hugger thing. I don't need to stick in the trees. Also, the music in this game is amazing. Absolutely amazing. All right. Oh, it's not, it's not gonna let me toggle my stats. So we're just gonna take the correct ruby, more bleed, more crit damage, more crit chance. We know we need it. We're only at 45%. So, we haven't gotten anything on the roulette wheel, so I knew we weren't maxed out yet. There's our, our runner boys. Um, so, if we take this, it only increases damage. If we take this, we take less damage. So, I vote more, more damage. Implodes kind of... It's okay, it's not great, it's not bad. Uh, range, we don't want that. Worms, we don't want that. We don't want silly saucers, so that only leaves us with one. 
one real option. Um, I like the regen, especially since I don't have meta progression, so it's kind of my only form of healing unless I get a drop. I want to get through here. Hopefully they don't explode on me. There we go. There we go. Keep going. Keep going. That's a, that's a good amount of XP in there. But, all right. Exploding volcano pool. So now they explode. Um, this is going to max it out. So they have a 15% chance to explode on death, dealing 9 AoE damage, leaving a pool dealing 2 damage every second. The explosion releases 3 volcanic orbs exploding on impact for 4 AoE damage. So it's just on itself over and over. And a magnet. Nice. Okay, so now we get Black Hole. This is implode leveled up. So you get attacks have a 12.5% chance to implode upon impact. So on our attacks, displacing and stunning enemies for 1.5 seconds and dealing 12 AOE damage to Black Hole spawns in the center, dealing an additional 5 AOE damage for each enemy hit. Um, so we are going to take a flat 15% damage increase. I like it. Um, okay, we will take a flat 20% damage increase. I like it. <laughs> that was a nice 35% damage increase from those two quick levels right there. So, um, yeah, we're doing okay. You know, once, once we kill something and those explosions start going off, that's that's when stuff starts getting real stuff starts happening for us um i'm trying to get away from things at the moment but i don't want to run into these guys because they explode on death there we go See? there we go you know what let's uh let's keep going with the black holes i like the stuns let's not run into the running boys Still at full life. This is a pretty good run um, for us. Let's we'll see how we end up doing with uh, some mini bosses and some bosses, but but we should be getting close to that here shortly. Um, so seem to handled those guys pretty well oh hey there we go we can get another 25 percent damage increase attack speed chain these are all pretty good i'm thinking just straight up damage i like it let's keep rolling with what we got because it's working i do like the attack speed idea we have a mom again so we know what this boss does. Shouldn't be too bad. Let's collect that magnet for, for funsies. Let's get a kill. That way stuff starts uh, exploding and our explosion causing more explosions. Hopefully get some of those explosions on a mom. to make everything come to him that way when we explode it we uh get the explosion damage on him since we have that fully leveled up but being this close to him also has its danger because he can just shoot us and and uh well that won't be good <laughs> 
We've been at full health for quite some time and I kind of like it. Alright, he's doing a different attack. We've got guys that are going to spawn more enemies. My mom's almost dead. There he goes. Alright, what do we get here? We get two times uh, tranquilizing mass. So we're going to have two tranquilizing mass masses that float around us and stun enemies for one second and deals 1.6 damage. So you'll see them. They're literally going to spin around us. Alright, so we can get the final upgrade of the ruby. Um, so it's going to give us an extra 10% crit chance, an extra 50% crit damage. And critical strikes have a 1% chance to cause a cardiac arrest, instantly killing the target. I have never seen that. So now we have a chance to instantly kill anything, huh? I like that. I like that a lot, actually. <laughs> um, so we're just going to kill these last few mobs. You know, we're, we're not the most DPS heavy build out there, but... But we're doing good. You know, for, for just starting the game, we're still full health. Doing pretty good there. Um, so, um, yeah, I, I can't complain. Yeah, we had, we had a couple rough runs, you know, but that's to be expected. We're brand new to the game. But this one's already lasted 15 minutes, so... You know, we're, we're, we're getting better. You know, meta progression surely helps every run get better and better and better. So, um, I really wish we did have more crit chance, though. Ooh, look at all these guys running at us. We're, we might have some explosions in store for them. Come on. There they go. We're gonna start it soon. They don't know yet. They don't know what's coming. There, see? They just didn't know. I had to, had to show them a little bit. Oh, we can get our goo. Let's do it. Let's get our goo. It can only help. Oh, we got some runners with, uh, with some armor. We'll take a little damage uh, getting away from them, but... We'll have to show these guys too. That's okay. I don't mind. I don't mind teaching them. They just don't know who Wiggle Woogle is yet, that's all. Well, that's not a good place to be. We're gonna get surrounded as soon as these guys explode. <laughs> Into, into more enemies, uh, that would have been bad. You can just hear, hear uh, all the explosions and the, and the XP dropping on the ground. All right, we got uh, that's more range guys over here. Oh jeez, oh jeez. They're gonna try to circle us. There's some XP. More goo, yes, please. Oh, yeah. There, that's nice. More goo, yes, please. So now we're gonna throw three goos out for 7.99 damage. I like it. the goo you can see it oh we just had a mini boss spawn been a while since we've had a mini boss in the in the mix let's find him there he is there's a mini boss i think he's the one that spawns more enemies i'm okay with that got a couple range guys right here another mini boss all right i like it keep them coming that's okay that just means more upgrades guys Except you had to bring the vacuum boy in. I don't really like him, but 
That's okay. That is okay. We'll just circle them around them, just like we have been. Kill the whole pack with explosions. And goo. You know, we can take a little bit of damage getting out of there. That's fine. Not a not a big deal. Let's uh, let's circle back this way. We got some runners there. You know we're we're gonna explode in here soon. All this group is gonna go away. Let's do uh, let's do more damage to higher higher health enemies. Let's do it. Uh, all these guys are high health. So that means we're just gonna keep doing more and more damage to them because, I mean, the mini bosses aren't high health, but we can do more damage to the other guys and kill them quicker, which means more explosions. I'm all right with that. All right, we got a Zigrid as our boss. But this time we have a little bit more movement speed, Zigrid. See, we can run right out of your stuff there. Oh, and we have the healing. So we can heal. I didn't pick up that health because we were full health already. Here we're, oh, we just had another mini boss spawn. You can see we're getting close to another level. There is the new mini boss. I'm gonna swing back around and try to hurt the mini bosses and Ziggurid some more. Still at full health. Still at full health. Oh, we got rid of Gurgitating Goose, so now we have a 20% chance to throw three homing goose. And they explode in a medium radius, dealing 12 damage, and has a 20% chance to regurgitate on, on impact, relaunching itself. Um, I got two words. Yes, please. Thank you very much. So we're we do we could use some attack speed that would really help launch the goose. But as you can see, it is now starting to annihilate more things a lot better because it is launching and then relaunching itself, which is nice. I don't know if it should have been called regurgitating because that's like vomiting. All right, we got one mini boss. What do we get? This is the, um, I will show you. This is this, which is our combo breaker. So now, lastly, it gives us uh, up to 500 experience or, or when we finish a combo. Oh, we got another mini boss down. We get 20% AOE at radius. That's just gonna help all our on death effects. That's gonna help our our black hole that's gonna help our goose I am not gonna complain about that at one bit I did just take a little bit of damage you can see the goo putting in its work against that mini boss there I know I'm kind of circling around uh, a wider berth this time, but I'm trying to uh, get to where I can put some damage in on Zigrid because we do need to get him damaged, not just the mini bosses. But I do want the mini bosses dead before before he dies. Because if uh, the level gets too too big or the the thing at the end after we kill the boss it gets too big it'll make us go to the next level and I want the upgrade from the mini boss um, 
And if I can't get to him, I can't kill him. There, we got him. No worries. And we got 10% attack speed. That is just what we want. Alright, let's go get Zigrid down now. Let's go see if we can't, uh... Goo him a little bit. S see how he likes the goo. And see how he likes our, our explosions. Before, I was just kind of playing it safe, but... If I can, if I can get up next to him, I'll, uh, we'll regurgitate some goo on him. If I can clear these guys out, you know, we'll just stand right here until we have to move because he's launching his attacks on us. Overall, this has been a great run for for our fourth run. You know, what what more could we have asked for for a fourth run? There we go, Ziggard's down. There we go. What kind of upgrades are we gonna get? Four of something. Four Sonic Sonic House into Ultrasonic Wave already. That's a little protection for us close up. And we just had another mini boss spawn. I don't think I'm going to be able to get that mini boss before we have to leave the level. Uh, increase our damage by another 25%. All damage has a 2.5% chance to be doubled. Yes. There is the mini boss in question. We will try. None of our AoEs are hitting the mini boss, so hopefully our goos have what it takes. Did we just annihilate him because of our 1% chance to instantly kill something? I think we did. I think we instantly killed that that guy. We got lucky right there. We got real lucky. Oh man. This this is such a great run. You know, now that I'm looking at it, maybe... Oh, we have another mini boss spawning. Maybe I could use a little more uh, range. My range is not that good. This this guy... He, uh, he has a bit more health. I'm not, not real certain how this is going to go. Um... He has 20,000 health, 23,000. Oh, maybe, maybe, oh, we got another mini boss spawning. He's already down halfway, never mind. He got deleted. Oh, this mini boss is over half dead already too. 10% AOE, sure, why not? Why not? Oh, he sucked me in. Oh gosh, we're getting surrounded. We're getting surrounded, boys. We're making a break for it. All right, that guy got deleted, and we get another thick hide. Why not give us uh, give us some more regen and let us uh, take some less damage? Even I like it. All right, so more crit damage. That's sixty-five percent crit damage. It's too late for this. We're doing it. More crit damage. I like it. What is our crit chance? It's still only 55. We haven't got anything on the roulette wheels. Nothing in the way of crit chance. We could use that. That would be huge. Oh gosh. I could use some health. I could use my regen to kick in. Oh, those guys exploded into uh, armored people. Let's take the fire. Yep, yeah, there he goes. Alright, we got two into splinters right there. Um, my combo ended, that's what deleted him. We're gonna, we're gonna run over here, we're gonna grab. 
Uh, I think we're gonna take damage for movement speed. I'm gonna grab one of these magnets. We're about to explode everything. Because these guys explode on death as it is. These bowls. Wow. I got really hairy and then all of a sudden everything was dead. That's kind of the way it goes in this game, it seems. Like, you're in a pinch, and then all of a sudden, there's nothing around you. And now, look, we're back to full health. We were scared just a second ago. We were scared of losing the run, but now we're back at full health, and... And, uh... Worrying about not having enough to kill. Our own death effects are really carrying us and our goo is surely helping. Uh, I am really curious to see what does the most damage uh, in this run. Is it going to be the goo or is it going to be our, our volcano? I think it's going to be the volcano. It's got to be the volcano. Oh, we can get another, our final level of black hole. Uh, a black hole spawns in the center, dealing 14 damage and spawning a feral black hole for each enemy hit. I don't know what the feral black hole is, but we'll go with it since it's its final upgrade. That was a big explosion. That was a huge explosion. Let's not have you guys behind me. I greatly appreciate that. I don't like not being able to go down here because of the rocks. Oh, I got rocks up here too. So, I guess I don't like it up here either. We're gonna stick around these rocks though. Oh, I don't, I don't need that health. I heard it drop. Saw it drop and I was like, oh, I should pick that up. But I was already back at full health again because of our combo thing. Oh, I'm not now, so might as well, I suppose. All of these guys are armored. Oh, I just can't go that way. I was trying to do this, but through that other hole and it didn't work. All right, this is gonna be the test. These big boys with the helmet. Uh, Gaia is very, those are Gaia. Those are some of her attacks that I just got hit by. Um, so this could be very difficult. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get to her. That is a problem. Uh, let's take obliteration. Oh, I can get to her, but I don't know if I'm going to be able to get majority of my damage on her. Because majority of my damage is from on death effects. Um... So maybe if these guys will die on her. We just had a mini boss spawn. It's probably not the best thing for us. Try, trying to fight Gaia with the mini boss. Um, there is an achievement for 100 Gaia kills. Um, so if we make this into a series, that will be something we are definitely going to go for. But that is a lot of kills for random bosses that spawn and you have no control over it another mini boss just spawned i need to get away from gaia she's already at thirteen thousand health she has less health than mini bosses spawn with so see oh maybe not that mini boss has twelve thousand, but you get the point if that one has 10k ow Oh gosh, that hurt. That one has 10k, that one has 9k. And luckily I have a little bit of regen. Um, because I'm playing really bad and running into getting hit by stuff I shouldn't be. Uh, 
and running straight into enemies, that doesn't help much either. Vacuum Boy's been slain, and you know what? I really don't want this. We're gonna dissolve it, get some, get, get a XP out of it. We'll take the 15% crit chance, yes please. All right, now back to Gaia. This is just another mini boss at this point. Gaia, you, you just have the health of a mini boss. What, what happened? And here I am sitting back at full life. You are getting pushed over here and I don't really like that though. I will say I don't like where you're positioned. But that is also my fault. And you're dead. What do we got? What you got for us guys? You got 40% damage multi. I love it. Straight up 14%, 40% damage multiplier. That is great. I will take that all day, every day. Take it right to the bank. Next level. Boy, what a good run. We're a half an hour into this run. This one run. I don't know how long we'll make it through this level. I don't know if we will make it through this level, but we're gonna give it a shot. Oh, I did have the tree hugger. We're going to take this because if I sit on trees, the arboreal gift is a free level. I thought that was the other run. But that is okay. Oh man, I was getting nuked by uh, ranged people. And I didn't even realize that. Oh gosh, I'm still getting nuked. I need, uh, I need to find some health. Or need to be able to let my regen happen. Getting hurt pretty good. There we go, we got some of the, the range guys out of there. Nope, nope, nope. Oh, this is not good. Yeah, that's the end of it. All right, so we got an artifact. We got Blob Moon. The blobs grow stronger. What else did we get? Twice as many enemies. So that just means more levels faster. Um. All right. Well, that was a good run, everybody. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, please like, subscribe, comment, and uh, let me know what you thought of our, our runs today. And um, Do I have 800 yet? I do not. So let's spend these real quick. Let's get some more XP, more health. Um, we're going to start with a higher crit chance, and we will do that. Uh, like and subscribe. Thank you, everybody. I appreciate you watching the video. Um, thank you for the support, and we will catch you in the next one. Later.